Hi everybody, we're going to do a question and answer today. Uh, we're going to be covering an item that's been in the collection for quite a long time, the City Hunter jacket. So what is the City Hunter jacket? It is somewhere between a sweater and a tailored jacket. You, know, you can wear it casually, you can wear it smart casual. Um, the origins of this jacket are the, um, it came from the Spanish Teba. Uh, which was a jacket created by this gentleman named the Count of Teba uh, in the middle of last century. And uh, he was actually inspired by an old English hunting jacket himself. So basically, we now have a jacket that's been inspired by a long line of country garments. And given that we were in Hong Kong, we decided to make a city version of it. So what are the special features of the City Hunter? Well, firstly, we typically do it in wool jersey. Uh, so the garment is made in Japan, the fabric is made in Japan. And we have found this great wool jersey that's very comfortable to wear, hence the sweater association. Uh, we do what's called a TPS seam for the construction of a lot of the seams. So this is a TPS seam. And some might even call it a seamless style of construction. Like if I was to flip that over, you can see that the fabric is two panels just mated together and then locked. And uh, when you wear it, it doesn't feel like anything. Like it's very comfortable as a result. Um, the original version, model version one, had a patch on the breast and then patch with flap on the hips. And then after we did this one, we came up with this, the City Hunter version two. So now I'm going to show you kind of how it fits. Uh, we reckon, we think it fits true to size, like this is how we expect it to fit. Um, I wear a size 48 jacket and this is a size 48 City Hunter. It is meant to be quite loose, like we like it to be very slouchy like this. And you know, given that a lot of people are working from home right now, um, I think this is a really good garment to be wearing in, that, in this situation. You know, like it's comfortable, it's smart enough that you can wear it on a Zoom call or a conference call, but it's also fine just to be in it all day long. What are the features of this? So uh, we did just open patches on the hip and we actually added an additional nested one right there. So the idea was actually that you could put a large cell phone in there, or, and to make the City Hunter more city, we did this, which is a narrow, tall pocket with a buttonable flap. And this is actually exactly the size for um, the kind of standard size iPhones, not the larger ones, or like a Google Pixel or a Samsung Galaxy Note, something like that. And you know, with a button, you can secure it and you won't worry about it slipping out. Okay, so that's the City Hunter 2. We have been doing special versions of these for our friends. And this is one of the most exciting ones we've done recently. So this is the Philips Perpetual Jacket. So the Philips Perpetual Jacket, in terms of the, the design, I mean the, uh, the model, it's the same. But we did this great navy and gray herringbone. And then we also did a very strong contrasting stitch in a very, like an off-white. So it's a little bit more casual than the normal City Hunter 2. And you know, one, what's lovely about this is uh, Philips very kindly decided to donate all proceeds of the jacket to charity. So it's all going to the World Health Organization's COVID fund. Um, so if you do decide to buy one, please have a look at Philips Perpetual's website. And uh, really it's for a great cause. Finally, uh, we also have a slightly more summery version of the City Hunter. So the City Hunter is probably good for three seasons. Like the fabric is not super heavy. You can actually layer it really nicely and I wear it most of the year, but I find it a little too warm for the summer. And then we have this. So this is the cotton linen version. So the cotton linen version is quite open. Like it's very breathable. The handle of the fabric is much drier and crisper. The only thing you lose is the TPS seams. Like with this sort of fabric, unfortunately we cannot do a TPS seam on it. So it's just traditional seams on this. And there you go. That is a little intro to the City Hunter jacket. Um, we're gonna do another video after this on how to style it and how to wear it. And uh, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.